here is what we are going to do. I have a picture and a title for it. I want to use the font color based on some color in the picture so the text looks more coordinated. How do I do that? I go to text fill and choose the eyedropper. Eyedropper is a new feature in 2013. Eyedropper picks up color from any place you take it to. The cursor changes to an eyedropper and whichever color is at the tip of the dropper is picked up. You can see that. So I'm going to choose this color. Now this color is looking nice here and not so nice here. So it needs a shadow. I'm going to go to word art styles, go to shadow. And this time again, I'm going to choose the color from here. But this time I'll choose it from the darker side of the carpet. This looks nicer. I'm going to increase the depth a little increase a blur letter and then change the text angle this is good enough for me now this is how you use eyedropper but wait there is a problem suppose i have another picture somewhere and i want to use some color from this picture let's say this brown color so i would expect myself to do this go to the picker and try to pick up the color outside the boundary of the slide and notice carefully what happens the moment I go outside the color picker itself disappears and it becomes a regular arrow which has no meaning so what do you do at this stage you would have concluded that PowerPoint has a limitation because the color picker works only in the boundary of the slide that's not true the only extra thing you have to do is drag the mouse don't just move the mouse cursor so when I drag it it can go anywhere and pick up the color so now I'm going to choose this color notice it changed there I like some other color from somewhere else which is neither on PowerPoint nor inside that picture notice I'm dragging it and I'm taking it anywhere I like for example I want this blue color no problem that also happens bottom line Understand eyedropper and also use the drag feature to pick up color from anywhere on the screen. That's it for now. Thank you.